Well, I'm uh, hiking up to West Lake today. I'm going to give the ravens a little bit more food because it's cold out for them. And, uh, well, they can probably survive, but I'm going to help them, help them out a bit anyway. If you want to see how much snow there is, we'll go like this here. Yeah. It's coming down. It's been coming down all day, so anyway. Here we go. <clears throat> yeah. Get to try out my waterproof shoes. Hopefully they're waterproof anyway. And hopefully my feet don't freeze off as well. I'm going to take the inside trail today because there should be a little less snow on the ground there. should be up on the trees there still because it's still freezing. Oh my god, I'm going to sneeze. It's pretty bright out here. <laughs> hey, Dewey! Oh my god, did I get any on the lens? Well, I sure in the hell hope not. Anyway, I'm bringing them some chicken. Hopefully they like chicken. Ah, oh, hell, I know they do already. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. I've just been doing this walk every day to try and get back in shape after my surgery and my radiation treatments that I've been going through for prostate cancer. Uh, it's not a not an easy thing to go through. But they say for some people it's a lot easier than others, but it really kicked the crap out of me. It's okay though. Uh, I just hope that the operation and the uh, radiation uh, took care of the issues. I'll know probably within a month or two. Yeah, as you can see, I get winded pretty easy. And they said that I was going to be feeling a little worse. Well, quite a bit worse actually after the radiation. And they've been partially right. I had to get some uh, prescriptions for some special meds faxed up here. And the meds work really good. I actually feel pretty decent. So the only thing that gets me now is I get tired really, really, really easy. But uh, still, it's okay. I'm feeling way better than I did before I had the operation and the radiation treatment. Anyway, I'll turn the camera around and show you what I'm walking up. <laughs> These birds better appreciate the chicken I'm giving them. I call these guys black chickens because, well, because I put the food out for them and I stand 50 feet away and they still don't come down and get it. They're very afraid. But then every once in a while, the male comes down and... <clears throat> like I've gotten within, what, six, seven feet of them. With no issues. Here we are, the upper part of the trail, heading to the lake. Oh, yeah, it's, it's a nice day. It's not freezing cold like it was yesterday. Yesterday with the wind, it was... Oh, well, it's probably minus 10. Uh, it was minus 5 in real life without the wind chill. But, oh, today is a lot nicer. Snow is nice and light still, though. And uh, I like that. If it's going to clear up, I hope it does it overnight, like it gets really warm overnight and starts raining and washes it all away. Don't like driving in it if it's sloppy. Oh, there's a lot of people in PR that don't know how to drive in snow <clears throat> and uh, we don't want to have accidents there are too many of them already here yeah anyway let's hope these ravens are up here might take them a little while to get come around we'll see what happens oh, looks like somebody else has been up here today at least one what they would have gone up and down. Oh, I can't tell. Oh, they did have a dog too, it looks like. Yep, there's a dog. Oh. Oh. 
can't stay very long because I'll end up freezing and I can't do that. Freezing is not good for me. It takes me a long time to get warm again. <clears throat> yeah. Anyway, this is the trail up to, or one of the trails up to West Lake. I like this one here because it takes me to uh, probably the best, well, one of the best swimming places up here. Yeah, this lake here is, it's West Lake, and uh, its official name is Hamill Lake, though. That's what some new, well, most of the new people know it as, but us people that grew up here, we know it as West Lake. Uh, as you see, I'm going around places on the trail because I know that there's big puddles and I don't want to step through the, uh, or step on the ice that's there and go right through into the goo because it's muddy. Not interested in having to wash out my shoes. It'll take a couple days to dry and then won't be able to get out for a couple days. Yeah. Anyway, I just heard the ravens. They're up here. They're looking for some food. That's good. I won't disappoint them. They actually really like mojos. I guess the starch in the, in the potatoes uh, helps them keep heat. And then I give them, well, a bit of the fatty skin off of the uh, off of the chicken, and then also the bones. They just crack open the bones and eat everything they can. Yeah, it's interesting. These birds are are pretty cool. We've been feeding them for what two and a half, three years now. I'm surprised they don't come in closer, but that's okay. If they don't want to, they don't want to. That's the way she goes. Oh, I just see another little bird there, right on the side of the trail. Yeah. Oh, yeah, and there's some other little birds up here too. Don't know what they're called. They're brown and black. Nice and colorful. And they, they love pecking away at the mojos too. So, I'll probably see them again up here. Oh. Look at that, just about here, around a couple corners here, and boom, there's the lake. I wonder if the lake froze over a little bit. The snow coming down, mixing with the water. Snow's cold, right? We'll see. Oh. <clears throat> yeah, the first time in Paul River we've had any real decent snowfall in a while, so that's nice. I, I, don't, I don't mind it at all. Just you have to, uh, just have to be careful. That's all. Here's another one of those puddles that you have to walk up on the side. Oh, let's see. There's our raven up top there. Nice. Yeah, and there's a little bit of, a little bit of ice and slush on the, uh, on the place here. That's cool. I'm gonna go around the corner, right up top there. There's a raven up in the tree. Woo. I got food. Wow, the branches are getting pretty low. Whoa! It's coming and landing on me. There we go. Oh, seen a couple little birdies flying around too. They'll be looking for food. Let's see what happens here. Oh, it's all stomped down from yesterday. Bruce was up here with me. There's been some dogs too. Wow. Right in the back there you can see that plank. That's uh, the place I've been feeding the ravens there. Just put some mojos on there. So we'll see if they go for it. I think they will. I think I just heard one coming in. So we'll see. There he is. Look at him. Look at you. Look at you. What a good birdie. Come on. Come and get the food. Come on. Don't be a chicken. That's right. Good birdie. Good birdie. You're fine. You're fine. Come on. There you go. Up, up. Up, up. Up, up. Good birdie. Yeah, good birdie. Oh, eat. get some more. Come on, get some more. Come on. Good birdie. There you go. There you go. I'm not doing anything, see? Don't worry about me. 
I'm the good guy. I don't do anything bad. Oh, there's more. Get the rest of it. Go get it. Oh, you did part of it. There's one more, but okay. Okay. 